Welcome everyone to Rosie Dazzy's Life. Today will be heart-shaped Rice Krispie Treats. These are so easy to make. What I'm going to do is I'm starting off with some butter and some marshmallows and I'm just heating them until they begin to melt. Make sure you continue to have your fire low because these are easy to burn and we don't want the burn. We're almost there. These are looking absolutely delicious already. <laughs> All right, the consistency that we want is this here to where it pours off of the spoon very easily. See how it's all smooth? Now we're going to add in the cereal, the Rice Krispies, and we're just going to mix those until everything is all combined. Doesn't that look good, y'all? So delicious. Never put too much cereal in or else you'll have very hard Rice Krispie treats. You want them to melt in your mouth. So now what I'm going to do is after I mix them, I put them all down on a piece of parchment paper so I can get them flat so I can go on ahead and start making my heart impressions. And now see what you need to do is you need to use your hands as well. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put some gloves on and I'm going to go on ahead and start smashing them down because I want them to be at a certain height. So when I use my stencil, they'll all be like the same height. You don't want them thin and you don't want them too thick, but you know, to each his own, it's up to you. So here we have it. They are at a very, very good height for me. So now I'm gonna go on ahead and start Pushing out my hearts, y'all. All right, so now I'm just gonna push this one and then I'm just going to move it around to get it away from the rest of the Rice Krispie Treats. Perfect, right? So easy. And you can do this with, of course, any kind of stencil. Or you can just put them in a pan, smash them down. So you can just go on ahead and eat them. You only get with them because they're good. And this recipe yielded me seven big hearts. And I only used one bag of marshmallows. And so I'm just gonna continue on making these hearts. And then the good part comes in just a minute. Doesn't those look perfect? Just pull the excess marshmallows away from the heart and hey, here you have it, your heart. I've melted some white chocolate, and so that's what I'm going to be dipping them in. Make sure your chocolate is smooth. All right, time to give them a dip. I'm just gonna do half of a heart. And you can, of course, use milk chocolate as well. All right, I'm going to go on ahead. I'm gonna finish dipping my hearts into the white chocolate, and then we will start decorating these. You can make these for any occasion. If you had footballs, you can make them for a Super Bowl or a baby boy's baby shower or a birthday. You can make hearts, you can make anything as long as you have that stencil. So easy and delicious. Here they all are. So now it's time to go on ahead and put some of these M&Ms on here. And of course, you can use any decoration that you want. I will also be using some mini morsels too. And then I'm going to color some of that white chocolate to make it kind of pink. Look at that. And don't worry about the extra chocolate because when you take it off the parchment paper, once it cool, you can either break it off or just enjoy it. It will not take away from any of this beautiful, beautiful decorations that you are doing to your Rice Krispie Treats.
that's the one that I used a little bit of the red food coloring. All right, y'all, y'all enjoyed these special Rice Krispie treats that guess who made? You made. Absolutely easy and delicious. I thank you all for your time. And y'all, please stay safe because I want to see you all on the next video. And tell a friend about Rosie Dazzy's life. Let them know what your girl doing on this channel. All right, now y'all don't forget to wash your hands, please, and leave your shoes where? At the door. All right, y'all, until next time, I want you guys to enjoy these and leave me a comment how they turned out. All right, you guys, I am out.